Courtney Davis, and welcome to the third annual Algminer Summer Benefit. If you're ready, let's get this party started. Forbes writer Richard Behar, who we are honoring tonight, and we are so lucky to have him. Who are you excited about seeing tonight? And I'm thrilled that the Attorney General Mike Mukasey and yes. Ken Kirsten and uh, Rabbi Shmuley, I oh, see, Rabbi is on the list. Yeah, can you believe it? So how did you first hear about the Augminer? You know, they're doing some very solid reporting. It's a must read every morning. I'm with the editor of the New York Observer, Ken Kirsten. Do you know what an algaminer is? I, I had heard that there was this publication that was going to uh, take a fr fresh perspective on Jewish issues in Israel. Everyone's hair looks so good. I don't know if it's a scheitel or... That's the problem with Jewish events. I'm here with Barry Shipman. I just want to know, boxers or briefs? Oh, boxers all the way. Hello. All right, tell us how you got involved with the Algaminer. Uh, it's hard not to get involved when David asks you to do something. He's a very <laughs> influential uh, guy in the Jewish community and really works hard to make sure that Algemeyer is doing great and just the whole Jewish community is looked after and taken care of. I'm with the editor of the Algaminer, David Ifune. I know everyone here is dying to know boxers or briefs. <laughs> <laughs> always, always, always never reveal what you wear. Oh gosh, he's very mysterious this one, I tell you. Did you guys do anything else besides find a babysitter to celebrate? That's none of your business. <laughs> I asked Dovid boxers or briefs, and he basically gave me the same response. It's a very um, top secret couple. We practice. <laughs> Power couple, they practice. I like that. Can you say your name, please? Uh, Rotem Gesevich. <laughs> okay. That is much cooler than Courtney Davis, I have to say. Do you speak Hebrew? Yeah, Obviously. Yeah. Say, I love the Algeminer. And you love the Algeminer. Oh my god. <laughs> I had one job to get the Attorney General, and I didn't get him. One job, I had one job. And I salute you and the Algemeiner global community for the hard work you're putting in to tell the real story. You know, unlike so many Jewish publications that target an insular Jewish community, uh, the Algemeiner, it's a Jewish take on global matters for a global audience which is a great perspective. I know you run the annual list of top billionaires. I just want to know, maybe you could run an annual list of the top, you know, blonde Jewish girls who want to meet those billionaires. <laughs> <laughs> so much for being here. This was an incredible night. The Algeminer is amazing and I cannot wait for next year.